The Yuva family spend a lot of time at the preschool, so I decided to turn up to see exactly how the boys interact with the other children. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? Yeah. Hi, nice good, to meet you good, again. Good. Thank you. Look at this, look. Yeah, this is my preschool. I left Rosemary to get on with some work and went out back to the playground. It was a nice experience to walk into Mum's preschool and see all these little children running around. And then there was Trevor and Travis sticking out like two sore thumbs. Just destroying the property in the backyard. No, you know that you're not allowed to be doing this, Trevor. Intimidating, picking on other children. Look at this. Hi, Travis. Do you girls play with Trevor and Travis? So what do you girls do when that happens? We run the other way when he's trying to throw it at us. Mm. Trevor, do not throw balls at her. Trevor is always winning. Take a shot! Trevor and Travis are the most naughty in that playground. And Mum and Dad just ignore it. Do not throw balls at them. You are going to hurt them. No, 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 no. Look at the little girls in there shuddering because of the way Trevor's behaving. Yeah! That's intimidation. And he's bullying. Why did you just hit her with the ball after I asked you to stop? Yeah. Trevor, come here. I'm not going to chase after you. Um, what do you do as far as any form of discipline? For Trevor, it's normally I send him into his mom. I just, it stresses me out. You know, I have 15 yeah, other children exactly. that I have to watch. When my kids act up or around other children, I just kind of feel helpless. Let me go down the slide, guys. Where the f is my ball? Oh. Do not use those words outside for my other children to hear. The teachers are in a no-win situation. They would normally call the parents to come and collect the child, but the parents are their boss who own the preschool, and the bosses do nothing to curb their children's behavior. Have a seat right now. Do you need me to go get your mom? Oh, I've seen plenty here. Mum and Dad have got complacent with the boys, and that needs to change. My word, a business that belongs to the family, and I'm sure you're very proud. I am of that preschool. It's taken a lot of hard work for it to be successful, so well done. But when did you give up? A couple months ago. No, it's been longer than that. Well, it all changed once I purchased the school. It's mine! Travis taking the ball from that young girl over there. Come here. Okay, let's go talk to him, okay? I saw Travis take a basketball off a little girl, and Mum went over to correct what had happened. Did you take this ball from her? I got it. It was mine. Did you take this ball from Breezy? I got this one. Are you not sharing? It's mine. I got it. Instead, she pacified Travis, so I had to pull her away and have a word with her. I wasn't happy with what I saw. You can't discipline your own child. I feel bad because he's mine and I don't want him to be mad at me. And it's easier for me to continue working and just let him Can you hear what you're saying? I just thought, Rosemary, cut the excuses. Take some responsibility here. Let me tell you something, and this is straight now. Rosemary, if you don't get a grip, you're in for a big lot of trouble, let me tell you. You've got two boys, four and seven, that have got attitude. If you don't remain consistent when you're in your own school, then what are you going to be doing for them? I just don't know how to get them to know the rules and to read. By doing it, Rosemary, you know where to put those children when they're aggressive. You place them straight onto a naughty bench. The tools have been set up for you, but you've got to want it. I do. That's why you're then here. Then show me. Show yourself. Show your husband. Show your kids. So where do I start? You start right here. Joe is. I feel as though is a little hard on me but I know she does it for the right reasons. I just want my life back. Then take it and say, right, I'm going to change things. Come on. It ain't that bad, huh? It ain't that bad. You can do it. You can do it.